Okay, hi there. My name is Mr. Ruthier, Trick Ruthier, and I will be teaching um, about sprite sheets and a little bit about animation. What the point of this exercise is, is I'm teaching my sixth graders how to animate uh, and create video games in Scratch. So, we're going to start out with the sprite sheet. Okay, sprite sheets are very cool. Basically, they're just um, images that are filled with all of the little sprite pictures that you would see from an old video game. For example, here you can see on my screen um, an old, um, I think this is a Super Nintendo Street Fighter game. And you can see all the different images of Ken on here. So any, any type of game you wanted to, to create, um, whether it would be you know Sonic or Mario or uh, Aladdin, anything, you can find these street, street <laughs> sprite sheets out there. Um, in a look here, spriteresources.com. Uh, let's see, do I have any other amazing uh, websites that have these things? You can just you, you, these things are all over the place. So all you got to do is click on search for sprite sheet. Go to your images, and you will see loads and loads of these things. Cool. Well, let's go for uh, Ken. And what I'm going to do, first thing you need to do is to download this. You right-click on this little guy. You say Save Picture As. And I am going to put him in my My Documents and my Sprite created a little folder called sprites. You can put them in your my pictures or, you know, wherever you want. And I'm going to name this Ken Sprite Sheet. It's always important to name your things properly. Okay, very good. Now we've got that. What we're going to do now is we're going to edit this sprite sheet. We're going to pull some of these sprites out so that we can um, use them in Scratch. So to do that, let's go to where our sprites are. Always pay attention to where you save things. So I put them in My Documents and um, Sprites. And there you are. And there's Ken. Okay, so I'm going to double click on this. It is automatically going to open up Fireworks for us because that is our graphic editor of choice here at Sug Middle School. Hooray, hooray. And let's zoom in a little bit so we can see these better. And I think we'll take uh, Ken this fourth row one here where he's having a little fight, these four sprites, let's use those. Uh, and you could use any graphic editor you wanted to do this. Uh, they've all got a, uh, you know, a crop tool. You just click on the crop tool, and I am going to place that around him. Hit enter, and boom, there we go. Uh, now we're going to use the magic wand tool. And just click on the outside. Let's get rid of all this stuff. We don't need that. And then we're going to do our file save as. And again, we'll put it in the sprite section, in the sprite folder. And let's give this a good name. Always name your things nicely. We're going to name this Ken1. Okay. Because um, he's our first one. We want the, to save these in order because it makes it easier to animate them. Now, to get our sprite sheet back, what we can do is we can just do control Z four or five times, and boom, there we go. We've got the whole thing back. And repeat. You're going to do this four times to get your sprites. Very nice. And we're going to grab that old magic wand, blast this stuff away, file save as. Call it Ken2. Hooray. Okay, and just keep going. Okay, here's my third one. Make sure you, you know, you get all of the little guy in there. Hit enter. Magic wand. How delightful. File save as. I hope you're not getting bored. <laughs> Pay attention. This is good fun. 
right, undo, and then we'll get the last one. Excellent. Excellent. Anybody a fan of The Simpsons? Excellent. Okay, good. File save as. We'll call that Ken 4. <coughs> Excuse me. And let's save it. Good. All right, let's uh, turn the old um, fireworks off. Very nice. Okay, now we've got our sprites. Let's go to Scratch, and I'll show you how to animate them. We use something called Costumes. It's very cool. Okay, where's that little kitty? Scratch's uh, mascot is, of course, the little kit, cat. cat. <coughs> Hello there, little kitty cat. Uh, but sorry, we don't need you, so we're going to delete you. And what we want to do is we want to get the first Ken in there. So we're going to use the click on that little folder. And I think I saved it on in the uh, Charles Ruthier folder. And then I go down to My Documents. Oops, that's not My Documents. Oh, I'm already in My Documents. Cool. All right, so let's look for the Sprites folder. Yay. And there's Ken 1. Ready for Ken 1. Okay, good. Now we've got our sprite. Now this sprite is going to animate. We don't want to bring any more versions of the sprite in. We're going to bring in, they're called costumes. When you animate this thing, click on the costumes, and we're going to bring in the other three Kens in the costume area. Okay, so we'll click on import. There's Ken 2. Import, Ken 3, import, Ken 4. Sweet. Okay. So, uh, notice that the version of Sprite 1. Oh my god, my cat stacked me. <laughs> Get down. <laughs> okay. <laughs> she likes to jump on my laptop. Um, okay, so you can see the, the version of Ken changes here. We, we always want to start with the first one, and we'll make sure that happens. Cool. So now let's go to our scripts. And then let's write, let's say we were making like a fighting program where we're going to have, you know, Ken punch. And uh, let's say the A key makes him punch. Uh, okay, what we do is we start out with control, as you guys that have played with Scratch know. You bring in the when space key pressed, we'll change that to A. And then when the A key gets pressed, we want to activate the animation. Uh, and to do that, uh, there are four pictures of Ken. So we're going to bring in the repeat 10. Let's change that to four. And then inside there, we will go to looks, and we will put in the next costume. Okay, and now when I press the A key, let's see what happens. Okay, that is kind of cool, but it's super fast. So I'm thinking we should probably slow that down a little bit back to the control and we'll use wait. Guys that have been programming with me know about this. And let's change that to a tenth of a second and see what we have now. Ah, that's look at it's like slow motion. Alright, let's go to a twentieth of a second. Point zero five and we'll try again. A. Okay, I, I'm buying that. That's pretty good. Okay, so that is how you set up the animation. Um, if you actually want to, you know, hit another character or, you know, have them fight or whatever, uh, that'll have to be another video. We'll have to, uh, I'll play around with that later. Uh, for now, what I want you to do is practice um, downloading these sprite sheets, pull off some sprites that are in animation, put, pull them into Scratch and see if you can create these cool little um, animations the way I did. All right, good job.